Welcome back, folks, to more Let's Play Pokemon Sword, the Isle of Armor. In the last episode, we defeated Clara and we completed all of the trials, I guess, at this area, so that's quite nice. You right, mate? Ah, there you are, Mastrath. Keeping this old man waiting, hmm? Since you've completed your three trials, I give you the secret armor of the Master Dojo. Okay, what is it? A bit, it better look good. Now then, come on out! Uh, oh, it... It's not actual armor. I was kind of wanting armor. Instead I get this grumpy bear thing. That likes to kick and punch stuff. Alright, 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 alright. I get it, I get it, mate. Nice, ah, scared! <laughs> it's kind of adorable in a weird way. Not gonna lie. Also, I think we're at that stage where my hair is actually like my characters. Now? Still in lockdown. So, barbers aren't open at the moment. Yeah. Bear indeed. It is indeed a bear. This Pokemon is in fact the secret armor of the Master Dojo. Say hello to Cubfu. Cubfu? Not to be mistaken with Cub Chew, I think. That's a more adorable bear that has snot dripping out of its nose. N different Pokemon. I know, I know, it's tiny. But raise it with diligence. It'll become strong enough to see you through any battle. Just like a suit of armor. No opponent will be able to get past it. There's one in particular has amazing potential. Problem is, it's a bit shy. Doesn't seem to ho have much confidence in itself. So I was thinking, Mastrath, maybe if it joins you on your adventure, that'll help it break out of its shell a little bit. So take care of Kubfu, okay? It's in your hands now. Come on, little buddy. Join the winning team! Bear Ma! No! Bear Pa! Bear, bear, bear someone, I don't know. We're not gonna do a. Uh, we're not gonna do a Gen, Gen 7 with him, are we? Come on, walk to the man in leather! Cub Fu has become a Pokemon, yay! Nice, we got ourselves Cub Fu! The Wushu Pokemon! Fighting type Pokemon. Uh, it's two foot tall, 26 and a half pounds. Cub Fu trains hard to perfect its moves. The moves it masters will determine which form it takes when it evolves. Oh, it can evolve. Nice. I know this is the legendary Pokemon of this sort of area, so you get it here. Um, on a nice note. There. You're a fighting bear. So, it's probably a very generic name. But Sonic, you shall be per Po, the Kung Fu Panda, I mean bear. There you go. And we'll send to the box for the moment. There you go. Now then, the first thing for you to do is become best friends with Kung Fu. You need to build trust. Kung Fu hasn't really had a chance to explore the world outside the dojo, so... Maybe it'll help you bet better become friends if you have it, if you let it have a look around. Maybe take it to a spot that has a great view of the Isle of Armor. I'll keep my students standing at good spots, so keep an eye out. And of course, having battles or camping out together will also help you become more friendly toward each other. What else? Oh, I know. Hereby grant you permission to keep a Pokemon out of its Pokeball here on the Isle of Armor. You can now let the Pokemon at the head of your team out of its Pokeball and take it for a stroll. Oh, are we going back to Heart Gold Soul Silver? Oh, I hope so. You'll be friends in no time if you walk together. Go and take a stroll with Kubfu, why don't you? Once your best buddies will start Kubfu's training in earnest. 
drop by and let me know once you think you're ready. I'm sure the game will tell me when I'm ready. Sorry, mate. I've already boxed you. <laughs> I guess I have to take it out of the box. I guess. And I keep pressing the wrong bloody button. Oh, that is awkward. What is up with my controls? Hang on. Is it this? Hang on, let me just remove that. There you go, it's gone. Don't know what that was. That was annoying. It just kept going left for some reason. That was rather frustrating. Seems to have gone now. Alright, we'll open up our... Uh... Yeah, we'll swap Pokemon. Actually, we can't. Ah, oh, yeah, Arter boxes. There you go. <laughs> Big buttons saying there. I guess we'll have to... Oh, it's level 10. Ugh, that's pretty bad. Alright, who wants to go in the box? Rivenance, you want to go in the box? You're probably my weakest Pokemon now. Probably. R Rivenance was another Pokemon that I was considering uh, getting rid of and replacing. So, yeah. Oh, although there's Obstagoon. He's still there. He's still about. Uh, but I've also spent time sort of like evolving all of my Pokemon uh, that I've got at this point. Apart from Type Null, that is. All right, Poe, you want to be at the f you want to be at the front of the team. You can be at the front of the team, but I want to show off the rest of them at uh, in walking distance as well. Become friendly with Cubfu and show it to Master Mustard. Okay, where are you? There you are. Yeah, it's but it's a lot hard gold and soul silver. Only it looks a hell of a lot better. I wonder what they all look like now. Let's try Ryuk. See what Ryuk looks like. God, you're slow. Yeah, run. Run, you fat sod. Run. Run. There you go. Nice. All right, that's that, that's Ryuk. I wonder how Krampus is going to work with this. He's probably just going to be slow as hell. Come on out, Krampus. Yes. Yeah, he is pretty slow. <laughs> No, Krampus, no. Of course he'd be slow. All right, let's try... Uh, well, Sir Rook of D, I think we know what Sir Rook of D is going to look like. He's going to be... Yeah, he's going to be bloody huge. No one will ever mess with me now. Look at that. The old Sir Rook of D always looking awesome. Uh, Brittany, might as well have a look. Oh, I, oh, God. No, I've just had a thought in my mind. Okay, so there's Brittany. Come on. There you go. I've got something in my mind and I really need to check this out. What about Eternatus? There's Bongo. Yeah, Bongo. Bongo's pretty quick. I'll take that. I have to test this. Eternatus. Where are you, big sky worm? Bongo, don't worry. We'll get you back in a minute. What is Eternatus going to look like? Because Eternatus is bloody huge. That may not be Eternatus. Oh, that is. Alright. Not as impressive as I had initially thought. Also, is Etern Eternatus is slow as hell and he's yawning at me. Come on, you big Skyworm. Yeah, you really don't want to fight the big Skyworm. You really don't want to fight the big Skyworm. Alright, well, uh... Okay, we'll, get, we'll get Bongo back now. Oh, no. That is... Uh, that's Zation. Organization. Oh, sorry. Lerenard! Alright. Uh, so let's put uh, Poe at the, put, put the party. Or at the top of the party. And go to some spots. You've got to be fast, mate. Go on. Punch that Baneri in the face. Go on. You know you want to. You can't. I nearly ran into you as well. My apologies. Alright. So where do we need to go to show this Cub Fu how we do things here on the Isle of Armour? Okay, there are just areas that we can look out at. Alright. Oh, wow. We can't actually fly anywhere. Okay. That's interesting. So, we actually have to, we actually have to ride to those places. While poor Cub Fu gets left behind. <laughs> oh, wow. You actually can't keep... Uh, you, Cub Fu isn't behind for long. Fair enough. Let's bleed Confei there. We don't want to worry about him. 
Or Lopany. I don't care about you either. Or Buffalant. I'll take some Watts if you don't mind. Yeah. They really expect me to keep this guy on my team. I mean, he's level 10. I got levels. I got high level stuff. What is going on with my controls? Hang on. There is something wrong here. There we go. That's sorted it again. I'll just get some more good stuff. Genius Feather! Increase the special attack of a Pokemon. Not bad. Right, where the bloody hell are we? We are there. Yeah, we actually have to move to those places. Fair enough. Oh. That was not what I wanted to do. That was what I wanted to do. Yes. Challenge Beach! I challenged the beach to uh, a game of hopscotch. I don't know. Well, what's for me? Oh, oh god. I thought that was a wild encounter then, bloody ho. Thought it was a wild encounter, not a wild encounter. Alright, so. Oh, oh, was that a Pokeball? It was. Bottle of Zinc! Nice. Increase the special defense of a Pokemon. Nice. Not too bad. I'm going to go and uh, take all this stuff now, if you don't mind. More what? What you got to say? Oh, it's the... I saw the best Pokemon ever. No. No. I don't want to know what it is. Not after the Magnemite. Alright, so... Oh, there's a Pelipper there. A couple of Pelippers. Three Pelippers there. Alright, mate. This is the Tower of Waters. You're not ready to climb this tower. Leave this place. Well, that's just rude. Git. He's being rude for no reason now. Ooh, TM. And a Pokeball as well. Hmm. Liquidation. Okay. That's interesting. Mystic Water. Well, here's all your water stuff if you need it. Come on, Poe. Does Poe know how walls work? Doesn't bloody look like it. Look, Poe, come on. Oh god, first person Pokemon. No! No! Oh, with the, with the release of Pokemon Snap 2, can't wait. Uh, still has no idea what the bloody hell he's doing. Alright, can anyone actually learn Liquidation? They can't. It's a bit of a shame, actually. Liquidation's a pretty decent uh, water type move as well. Also, we don't have a water type move on our team, so that'd be very nice. Alright, so, just checking, this was one of the places, right? Nearly. I've got to go to Loop a Lagoon. So I've got to go, I'm guessing, left. So let's go left! There's Wingulls here. Cool. That Voltorb. That's an Octillery. Oh god. There! Ah, what the? That's a Gyarados. No, it's Sharpedo, actually. Actually, Sharpedo. Uh, Poe! No, 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 Poe. Oh, no. Oh, no, Poe. No, Poe. No. No. Bad, Poe. Don't be out. Don't be out in front. Especially not like that. Bongo, you've got this. God, you have to handhold this bloody thing. While uh, the rest of my Pokemon take a bloody beating. Speaking of beating. Let's go for a good old-fashioned drum beating! Take all the vines to the face. Good job, Bongo. That's why you solidified your spot on the team. Nice experience. Oh, wow. Poe is just leveling up like mad. Ten levels he got there. And wants to learn Aerial Ace. Nice. Yeah, let's get rid of Endure. For uh, a flying-type move that doesn't miss. Yes, we'll definitely get that. Airy Lace, Scary Face, no. Headbutt is better than Leer, so we'll get rid of Leer. So it's got Inner Focus, so he can't be flinched, so that's pretty good as well. Fair enough, alright. He's got, he's got the makings of a good start of a Pokemon, I'll say that. Ooh, is that an actual battle over there? It is, isn't it? No, Sharpedo, no! Not again! 
Go away, Sharpedos. They're everywhere here. Poe, no. What did I just tell you? You couldn't fight the last one. Yes, you're 10 levels higher, but you still can't fight them. God, if any of these Sharpedos have pursuit, I'd be screwed. Luckily, it looks like they don't. They're gonna go for crunches instead. Or agility. They're all alright, you may get another shot here. And Sharpedos, I think, are naturally pretty quick anyway, so. Would it really matter? No. You're gonna go for liquidation. Not as good as what the other one did. You, my friend, are a failure in comparison. Smack, 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 smack. Dead. Good job, Bongo. We need to be using you a lot here, I think. Just to prevent these Sharpedos. And you're up to level 71 as well. Nice. Pose up to 24. Wants to learn Brick Break. Now that's a good fighting type move. Goodbye, Rock Smash. Rock Smash is nice, but Brick Break's just better. There you go. Can bypass walls like... Uh, light Screen and Reflect. Ooh, item there. Muscle Feather increased the attack stat of the Pokemon. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. Get away from me, you prick. Oh, God, there's two of them. Do I have any repels to get rid of you? Because this is going to take a while and it's going to be annoying. I don't believe I do, so I'm probably going to have to fight them. Oh, God. <laughs> Dodging maneuvers! Go! Get the... Get the what? Dodging! No, it's not working! Damn, Sharpedos are everywhere. Should have invested in some repels, really, shouldn't I? Oh, if I knew that was coming. Why is a Sharpedo faster than my bike? Seriously, my bike should just absolutely ace those. But it doesn't. It should, damn it. Doesn't. Give me a faster bike. Speaking of fast, he's agility. He's agilitying. Agilitying again. No oh, good. Alright, let's go for uh, more drum beating. Ooh, takedown. That could be. Nah, crunch is still better for you. Against old Bongo. Well, you're just leveling up the Pokemon, so, uh. Nice job, Sharpedo, I guess. <clears throat> nice. Experience. Pose up a couple of levels as well, up to 27. Nice. Is there another Sharpedo on our ass? No! Finally! Get out of here, Sharpedo, you bastard. Oh god. That's not a Sharpedo. That is! Get away from me! Leave! So I'm actually gonna go here, screw you. Yo, these lovely items. A pearl! Yes, I'm just moving him out of the way. A bigger pearl! And a wishing piece! The wishing piece is nice. Oh, and there's a, uh... There's energy pouring out the den, and there's actually a battle there. Ooh. Oh, God. <laughs> He's still trying to attack me! Do you know what? Sod it. Let's actually do this one. Let's do this den on screen. Might as well. And then I'll get my Sharpedo. And then I'll fight with the Sharpedo or whatever. Probably. Right. Looks like... I don't know what it is specifically, but it looks like a bird. So uh, that's why I put Brittany in. It's a... Chinder. Man, that was loud. All right, Brittany. I mean, we've got this. we just got this. Also, one of them has got wishy-washy school form. All right. We've also got Mudbray and... Uh... Okay, not bad. All right, let's go for... Overdrive. Overdrive attack! And already half damage. Getting desperate. Of course you're getting bleeding desperate, mate. Go on, wishy-washy. Finish him off. Okay, Thunderfang from Crocorock. Good damage. Fair play. Max Airstream. Don't you dare. Not on Mudbray. I love Mudbray too much for him to die. You're a speeders, Rose. So. Rock Tomb. Have that, you sod. Yeah, Mudbray's too cool for you. 
Take that, sod. Yeah, now you're in red hell. And your defense is gone. Aqua Tail, you're dead. Nice job, wishy washy school form. Everyone likes you. Throw a Pokeball now. I sure will. Let's catch it in an ordinary one. Sod you, Fletchinder. Sod you. So why should get like fire and flying type moves for that? Might be the worst thing actually. Maybe we can get something more useful than burn up. Maybe. Who knows? One. Ooh. Three. Got it. Oh, nice. We got ourselves a nice Fletchinder. We got some experience candies, very nice. We got Tri Attack and Brave Bird, alright. That's interesting. That is interesting, I guess. Fair play, fair play. Well, we caught some of Fletchinder at least. The Ember Pokemon. La uh, Fletchinder launches uh, embers into the den of its prey. When the prey comes leaping out, Fletchinder's sharp talons finish it off. Um. Do you know your name is Fletchinder? So I'm going to call you Norman. For old Norman Stanley Fletcher from Porridge. Played by the late great Ronnie Barker. So there you go, your name is Norman. And I'll send you the box, because I have no need for you, Norman. Oh, at least the bloody Sharpedo's buggered off. That's quite nice. I might actually make... Never mind. I might actually make it to the area I want to make it to. Hang on, before you do anything, Sharpedo. Where do I need to go? Alright, I think I need to go there. The Sharpedo is not going to let me. Looks like it's not going to let me in this video because it's an ass. Brittany, yeah, you play around with your rubber breasts, I guess. I don't know what they are. I don't know what they are. Just to murder the Sharpedo a bit. There you go, <laughs> nice. All right, just having Brittany at the front is just so much better, really, than Poe, isn't it? Detect, yeah, no. Detect's all right for competitive play, but no, you don't want it. Oh, there's another one. Can we outspeed the Sharpedo? Can we get to this in time? Will it follow us? Bloody hell, is Gyarados here? Get away from me! Oh, God. And <laughs> immediately I run into Sandigast. No, not Sandigast. Brittany, you're terrible against Sandigast. Like, seriously, Sandigast can tank pretty much anything you've got bar Boom Burst. Actually, not even Boom Burst because it's part Ghost. So, yeah, you're, you're buggered, mate. You're buggered. All right, let's, uh, let's make it to that. One there. Do, 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 do. More Sandigasts. Oh, that was Brittany. Pearl String? Alright. Got Dread and all that. Ah, you must be one of them. Hi, Mastrath. you got to see the view from here. Come on, why don't you and Cub Fu enjoy the scenery together? Oh, okay. Cub Fu doesn't have to be at the top of the pie. With our, and our mouths are wide open. You're going to be able to catch a couple of flies if you keep doing that. Cub Fu seems to enjoy that. You feel like you're getting more friendly with Cub Fu. Bring your poke, bring your Pokemon. Oh, there. Being with your Pokemon makes everyday scenery feel brighter and more colourful, don't you think? Uh, I guess so. What the hell is that over there? Oh, that's just a that's that's just a twig. I thought it was like a dead carcass of a Pokemon. What what am I thinking? Anyway, guys, I'm gonna go for a break here. But in the next episode, let's play Pokemon Sword. The Isle of Armor DLC. Maybe, just maybe, we'll keep having, being ambushed by Sharpedos. Who knows? Anyway, I will see you then.